In today's Madden 21 video, I'm going to be breaking down some Chad Johnson gameplay and also going to be showing off a ebook that I am currently uh, writing and in process on in the New England Patriots offensive ebook. Now, this ebook, we're going to primarily show you today one of the formations, in my opinion, the best formation from it, which is a trips tight end. Um, but this ebook will encompass pretty much every. Um, formation that you can utilize in the new england patriots playbook and in my opinion will be the most comprehensive guide on uh the new england patriots uh offensive scheme so if you have not already uh subscribed or joined the text message membership we'll be giving out a free formation from that guide um to our text message members is 100 percent free to sign up for the text message membership and you can do that um, by texting me my cell phone number is 812-216- three six four four so i'd love to hear from you and if you have not already uh gotten signed up for that love to get you signed up um and again here's my personal cell phone number you can text me whenever you want ask madden questions all that stuff um but if you want to get that free um scheme breakdown when we release it which should be um should be this weekend um i've been writing it a lot in the last couple days but this offense is just insane and i just think it's one of the better um offenses that you can get now we're running it with brett Favre at quarterback we got reggie bush at running back and then here i've got stefan diggs and then i'm gonna put chad uh chad johnson at the inside slot receiver right there and we're gonna rock and roll so uh first things first this double in sale play in my opinion is one of the best plays in madden 21 um it just is a really really good flood concept and this running back route from trips tight end, I think, is just absolutely deadly. Now, most people, once they, once you establish this, um, this specific um, setup right here, what they're going to start to do is they're going to start to leverage and start to try to use or guard and use or defend the running back. So, um, as they're starting to do that, then I would highly encourage you going to um, multiple different floods. The cool part about trips tight end is it just causes so many. Um, alignment issues in my opinion uh, let's see here on this play right here we're just going to run a simple flood uh, on both sides of the field looks like he's going to go to his own coverage and we had our hitch route but we didn't take it um, I forgot to put tight end apprentice on Vernon Davis so I'm gonna have to I think I still have that on Darren Waller so I'm gonna go ahead and sub him in back in the game uh, in my opinion you do need a tight end apprentice to run this offense effectively um, tight end apprentice makes trips tight end like trip trips tight end is like a, a 9 out of 10 without tight end apprentice with tight end apprentice it becomes in my opinion the best um, most powerful offense in the game just with what you can do with the crossing routes the post routes the route combinations you can create um, once you have that route apprentice, it looks like I accidentally took it off. So you're going to be seeing this offense kind of half speed right now um, without that without that combination. But this offense is just insane, and a lot of the um, a lot of the competitive Madden players are running this this year. Now again, this is not just the the guide that we'll be writing on this will not just be trips tight end. It will be trips tight end. It will be u trips. It will be um, gun bunch it will be a lot of different things that we're going to showcase out of the new england patriots uh playbook so it will be more than just just the um more than just the um the trips tight end formation so anyway back to the gameplay here so um he's showing zone coverage this little motion slant is amazing uh against zone against man uh there stefan diggs was able to uh, magically drop the ball um, I need to get back into my base play. I've not been running uh, my my number one play, the play I must make go. And, and part of this, you know, when you're playing Madden, um, I highly, highly encourage you, if you don't have a base play, you need to get a base play. Um, it's just really, really critical uh, to your offense. Looks like we forgot to activate a lot of our superstars, so that's just awesome. But that's fine. And... We threw the crosser a little bit too early right there. We're going to go ahead and go for this. We're a little bit shaky on our reads um, right now. I think routes are wide open. We're just missing them. <laughs> and without our without our tight end apprentice, it does kind of limit a little bit of what you can do uh, from trips tight end. That's why, you know, in my opinion, you need a route apprentice uh, for this offense. This offense is really good when you have a route apprentice. All right, we're just going to shoot that guy up the seams, got the post, and we'll see if we can get some time in the pocket here. 
And there you see there's that motion slant on that side. Very effective for beating uh, max coverage. All right, so I'm going to go in a no huddle situation here. Um, and this is becoming one of my favorite uh, ways to run this doubles in sale. And Brett Favre just throws lasers. Darren Waller's going to get in, and we've got a reservation for six right off the bat. Um, now, due to me not having tight end apprentice in this video, you're going to see a little bit, like I said, a little bit more of a limited version of trips tight end. You're not going to see the full fledged everything that you can do, but uh, this formation and this ebook will feature one play touchdowns against every single coverage that you can face in Madden 21. Um, it'll feature film study um, from not just me, but from other really, really good players and how they use this offense um, as well. Because trip side end is one of the most popular offenses, and we're going to try to share with you some unique things that you can do, maybe a little bit different that maybe you haven't thought about. Now, again, trip side end is not the only thing we're going to include with this. This is going to include several different formations um, within the New England Patriots playbook. I think the New England Patriots, oh, we get a huge hit stick fumble right there. Um, I think the New England Patriots playbook is probably the best playbook in Madden 21 um, for more of mainstream what you're seeing um, in competitive play and things like that. You're going to see, I think people, you know, the Raiders playbook is really good if you just run trips tight end. So like if you run trips tight end and that's your thing and that's all you do, um, the Raiders playbook can get the job done in my opinion, but the Patriots playbook includes a really, really nice little bubble screen from this set. Um, and it also includes um, a formation or sorry, a route combination that you can utilize from gun U trips that can beat uh, completely destroy, you know, pretty much every defense in the game. So if you haven't already seen how good of an offense U trips is, all you need to do to um, understand the route concepts and things you can do is literally type into YouTube D Croft, one of the best players in Madden right now, and he has used U trips like a boss um, and has really um, done very well for himself with that specific formation. So uh, U trips is definitely a great formation to add into this scheme. And then there's also um, just different really, really good formations. Split close, a slot offset, gun bunch is in this playbook. Um, we're gonna show you some really, really good route combinations out of the gun bunch. Um, the cool part about the Patriots uh, playbook is they have a bunch of quick screens, a bunch of quick little plays that you can you can kind of use um, to really to your advantage. And what you'll see here, um, he's gonna run commit. This little RPO bubble is amazing on the goal line in my opinion. It might be the one of the best red zone plays that you can utilize. Um, the RPO bubble really does, in my opinion, make trip side in so hard to stop because what they have to do on the left side is they have to account for the flats. So they're going to have to play hard flats on the left side. Then they have to play hard flats on the right side. So you have them playing hard flats on both sides, but then you have crossing routes. When you have a tight end apprentice, you have dual crossing routes. So they're going to have to play 25-yard purples. And then you have um, you can hit them with the quick hitches from trips. The reason trips is so good, and the reason trips tight end specifically, I think is is really really good, is because you basically can create um, just with hot routes and just literally you don't have to do anything other than just use our hot routes. Um, but what trips can do for you is literally you can beat every zone in the game with just a couple of adjustments. There's really not a ton you have to do. Uh, to beat those zone coverages, and that to me is is what uh, makes this just a magical uh, offense. All right, my opponent's going to go to split close, and you see he's got that crosser right there, and he makes a bad throw on that route. All right, so first and foremost, let's get our right players in. We got Derek Thomas on one side, and then we should have Chandler Jones on the other side. Um, need to get Micah Hyde in here. Taylor Mays there, and then let's go Devin McCourty right here. And what I like to do on the first drive is just fill you out. Um, you'll see that I'll, I'll run a lot of man on the first drive just because I want to kind of see what you're going to do and how you're going to attack man-to-man -man coverage. Are you going to use corner routes, out routes? Like, what are the routes that you're going to go to? It looks like this guy is going to run a little trips tied in himself. Um, or, I'm sorry, gun a slot offset. Now, one thing you do have to be aware of when someone runs a slot is I have to be aware of the little power O right there it is, um, or O1 oh, trap. And what I think, you know, nickel 335, the run game has not been as good in the last several days um, with some of the recent patch-up days. I don't think, the, like, you can still run the ball, 
but I don't fear the run game like I did um, before. So like if he runs, like right there, he's got me. But um, from Nick, that's why I've kind of shifted back to nickel three three five because I think nickel three three five um normal just has the best zone concepts that you can use the only thing it doesn't have in it is a good um is a good match coverage um at least in the four six playbook it might have it from other playbooks but let's see here he's going to run some motion it's probably a one trap right here let's see what he does no nope. let's see if he takes his flat zone yep he does so good read by him and one coverage i'm actually really liking is cover four and you basically turn it into cover two against these like sets like this right here and there you see like i like i'm saying i think the the gap shoot from nickel 335 is much more improved uh with the recent patches of the game and the way that um people are kind of playing uh, let's see let's get these hard plots out there but when you play um, a formation like this i'm actually really liking this uh, defense right here for a lot of things they'd like to do of course as he dots me up for a nice little angle route uh, these angle routes to the running back are out of this world good and Ed Reed 99 zone did he get it I think he fell out of bounds but defensively so we've got Taylor Mays in the middle and he um, as far as abilities go I think we have um, out of my way on Taylor Mays. It's just to help with the run game. Um, and then let's see, we'll crosser. And that was terrible lurk. Oh man, that was bad. And he's going to just walk. Remember uh, right there in that situation, that's where I've got to be a little bit more effective um, with my user. Um, but basically, I got to get. You know, if he's going to scramble with Big Ben and Jair Alexander's going to take that all day. This is why I don't think, like, running – I've seen a lot of people running, like, Vernon Davis and Darren Waller. And in my opinion, that's a problem against man-to-man -man coverage. I think we're going to go ahead and get a quit here. But uh, just a little sneak preview of the uh, trips tight end offense, um, New England Patriots full scheme guide. Uh, at, as it sits right now, we're at three hours, and it's just on the trips tight end. So a lot of really, really good stuff in there. Uh, we'll also have some good quick starts guides as well. So, anyways, guys, if you want to, um, if you want to join our text message membership, you can get that free formation. I'd highly encourage you to go ahead and uh, just shoot me a text. My number is eight one two two one six three six four four. If you want to join our Discord, that's where we talk Madden twenty four seven. Would love to connect with you there. And uh, we will be posting on our YouTube channel when the guide goes live. So be sure to stay subscribed so you can pick that up if you want. Thanks for watching today's video. We'll be streaming this guide as well tonight with Chad Johnson. See ya.